Com. Piece of Colorado history undergoing some work right now to bring it back into the modern age while keeping its 1800s charm. Your report on the mountain, Spencer Wilson, explains why the EPA got involved in the restoration of the historic Belvedere Theater in Central City. The Belvedere Theater has been a staple for the Central City community since the late 1800s, but nobody's been up on this stage to do a performance for at least three decades at this point. Still, the city's not ready to close the curtain on this building quite yet. Construction is already moving along on the soon to be revamped theater, but it wasn't always a theater. It's evolved over the years. The actual theater became a bottling plant. It was during its, its history, uh, the fire department, a uh, gymnasium for the school district, a roller skating rink, uh, and eventually became a movie theater. Now, aside from plays and operas, the theater will be an open place for the community to gather for weddings or holiday parties. A far cry from the abandoned building it's been recently. The way it looks today is significantly different than it did in 2016. Bricks were falling off the front of the building. Uh, there were pigeons on the inside. The roof had big gaps. Water was leaking in. The building was in dire shapes. And it's a lot of work. You can't tell what's on the other side of some of this old brick. It's kind of like working blind. Plus, you bring into the fact that you're working into the side of a mountain, too. Not to mention they got help from the EPA to remove the asbestos from the walls. But they're trying to maintain the pieces of history that aren't bad for our health. And then you can actually see the this scorch mark here is from the fire of 1874. We're going to leave that there. A restoration of old timey Colorado made to last for years to come. Now seeing it being restored and coming back is amazing. And uh, I, I think I can safely say I speak for all residents that it just it, it just does this community good to see this building coming back. They're about halfway through their fundraising goal. They need an additional $4.5 million in order to get this thing finished. And they're hoping to be able to present it to the public on the 150th anniversary of Colorado joining the United States in 2026. In Central City, Spencer Wilson covering Colorado first. It's always amazing to look back yeah. at all that, isn't it? That's crazy. A trial.